After the enactment of the national security law, how did members of the Chamber of Commerce react? Do they feel positive about it or negative? What is their biggest concern? Well, it's both positive and negative, to be honest. Uh, positive in the sense that uh, the member think that uh, the NSL uh, will possibly bring back the social uh, order uh, after a year of uh, violent protests that disrupt our local uh, business environment. Smaller firm cannot do business, you know, under the situation of violent protests, and that's why uh, they hope, uh, you know, the NSL will bring the social order back, and that is they feel more positive. Negative in a sense that, uh, of course, the NSL, you know, attract a lot of foreign sanction, especially the U.S., and that create a lot of uncertainty to Hong Kong on the international trade because they never knows, you know, what. Uh, but not allowed to do and what the rules of the game will be changing and that will dis disrupt uh, our normal business operation. So um, in that sense, uh, our member feel uh, a bit quite negative. Did you do any survey among the members of the chamber? Well, we did uh, have a survey asking the member about the NSL and uh, what the impact on the business as well as uh, what the plan in the future. Uh, we came back uh, more than half actually feel a bit more positive towards the NSL because they believe that, as I said, will bring back uh, the social uh, order so that they can run their business uh, as uh, in the past. And uh, the rest uh, of the member who are feeling uh, negative because of the sanction, as I said. But so far we found that uh, not uh, many member plan moving out of the city. Anyhow, I mean, uh, uh, Asia is still a growing spot, you know, for this company, and they have been here many, many years doing business here. So, uh, I mean, uh, moving out of Hong Kong is not uh, such an easy decision.